Hey there, Internet. How's it going? I hope you're ready because it's time for Close Enough Cosplay, the cosplay show that's totally marvelous and quite obviously hilarious. This week, I'm cosplaying a superhero that's been in the news lately, Miss Marvel. Well, not the exact Miss Marvel that's in the news. I'm cosplaying the retro-style Carol Danvers version. I feel like it would be vaguely racist for me to cosplay a Pakistani girl. Although, I think it's really cool that Marvel is doing what they're doing, and it takes some really close-minded people to have a problem with it. I'm just saying. But serious stuff aside, it is episode 20 of Close Enough Cosplay, and I thought that deserves something kinda special. So it's time to bust out the Pax paint. The best part is, this costume is so skimpy that I'm not even gonna have to use that much paint. So I have some black paint, and I went out and bought some gold paint specifically for this costume. I'm going to mix the paint with the Ben Nye prosthetic adhesive that I have. I have a red scarf to wrap around my waist, and the thigh-high boots and gloves that I wore for the Catwoman outfit. Keeping it simple this week, guys. Last week was really complicated, so I've earned this. <laughs> Let's cosplay! I'm a motherfucking superhero! To be honest, I've broken kind of one of the first rules of cosplay with this costume. I don't really know anything about Miss Marvel. Uh, and when I looked it up, it kind of left me a little bit confused because she's got a couple of different origin stories. What I do know is that Miss Marvel's alter ego, I guess, is Carol Danvers. She was transformed into Miss Marvel after an accident in a lab where a piece of technology from a race called the Kree people exploded and merged her DNA with Kree DNA. Thus, Ms. Marvel was born. It's a little confusing, right? I This is what I surmised from Wikipedia. If I'm wrong, you let me know, but Carol Danvers currently is known as Captain Marvel. I think this turned out really awesome. I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling pretty sexy right now, especially because I'm putting up a YouTube video where I'm effectively wearing nothing but band-aids and panties. One thing I could say about this particular costume, though, is that it totally, like, backs up the fact that Stan Lee is just a giant perv. I guess I'm not really all that surprised since he was the brilliant mind behind Stripperella. I'm really actually glad that they took the Miss Marvel costume back a notch. This is what it looks like now. Much more reasonable, especially since this chick's all of 16 years old. So let's rate this costume. I really like it. I feel pretty super sexy right now, but it comes with all the problems that come along with body painting. Except for time. This costume went really quick, especially compared to all the other body painting that I've done on this channel. That shit took forever. But the thing is, is that it's not really good for outdoor wear because you're pretty much naked. Not to mention that the glue that the paint is mixed with is really, it's glue. It's sticky and it's not it's just not the easiest to deal with on a regular basis. I'm gonna give this costume three jugs. Although it did turn out pretty great. Cosplay complete. Remember, if you'd like to suggest characters for me to cosplay, go ahead and do it in the comments below. So for those of you that follow me on either Facebook or Twitter, you already know this, but let me just repeat myself for those that may not know. I'm giving away the drawings that have been featured in my videos so far. All you have to do is share my video on your favorite social network and let me know. You'll then get your choice of any of the drawings that I still have available. There's a bunch of them, so share this video and you'll be entered for a chance to win. Congratulations to Twitter user Camelina7 who won this week's drawing. Well, with all that being said, remember to like, favorite, share, subscribe, and do all of those things I always ask you to do. I'm Moonshine Bonanza and I hope you guys had a great day today and I will see you the next time I post a video. Later.